Hey guys, yeah, I don't know what happened that last time. Uh, stupid thing cut me off at about uh, right at 12 minutes. So I went it went through, tried to figure out what it was, and my wife had recorded some stuff on this device, and it had apparently taken up all the space. So yeah, I'm gonna throw her under the bus. But anyway, so I went in, deleted the extra stuff, and uh, so we're gonna start now and. Try to get through as much of this as we can. Anyway, this is part two uh, of my Heroes Con haul. I picked up a few um, issues of Patel. Picked up number three, number five, number nine, number fourteen. 15, 16, and 18. These came out of a, uh, it's either 50 cent or dollar bin. Anyway, this is a great series. Um, I would recommend it if you can pick them up cheap. Uh, this is a kind of a strange tale to try to describe. It's not a superhero tale. It's more of a combination of H.P. Lovecraft, crime noir, um, <laughs> and several other genres, but the only constant character, well there's a couple of constant characters, but the main character is this lady you see on the cover of this book, and she's on the cover of several other ones. Anyway, it's, uh, like I said, a great story pick them up cheap. Found this copy of Action Comics number 314 in a dollar bin, which is about what it's worth. It's in pretty rough shape. But anyway, it's, cover, it's, it's got a cover and it's complete, so can't complain too much. I read it last night and this is your typical early 60s Superman story. That's really the best way to describe it. It's, it's 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 pretty cool though, and you get to see some appearances of some of Superman's uh, some of Superman's uh, compadres in the Justice League. So pretty cool. Picked up uh, several Astro City books. Uh, got uh, this is Dark Age book three number one. Pretty sure that's the last one I need in that little four issue run. Got Dark Age Book 4, Number 2. Got Astro City, the new series, Number 6. Number 9. Number 10. Number 12. This is a great story. If you can find this issue cheap, uh, pick it up. It's, it's pretty cool. Number 13. Number 14, great cover. 15, 17, 18, 19, and 34 was fortunate enough to find some of the first series. Got number four and number five. So I think the only one I need out of this little short six issue run is number six. Also picked up number two of the second series. So I think the only one I need now from that is number one. Found these Final Crisis books in 50 cent bins. I picked up number two. Number three. Great Supergirl cover. Love that cover. Number four. And number seven. Also picked up, uh, I have a couple of these, but I picked these up to complete it. Uh, 
It's an offshoot of Final Crisis, as you can see. It's uh, called Legion of Three Worlds. This is number two. Number three. And number four. I was fortunate enough to pick up, already got uh, number one and number five. So that completes that run of that. Looking, really, really looking forward to reading these. Got Legion of Superheroes, formerly Superboy, number 272. 276. Two eighty five, two ninety six, two ninety nine, three oh six, three oh seven, get those out of the way. 308, 309, 312, 317, 318, 324, 328, this cover, and I'd have to actually pull it and look, but I think this, excuse me, this is 326. I think I said 328. Anyway, I think this is the same cover that's on the Baxter series of Legion of Superheroes. If it's not the same one, it's, it's very, very similar. Anyway, 326, 327, 328. 343, 349, and picked up a few old uh, Avengers comics, got number 72, and again, as I've said before, pay no attention to the price on the uh, sticker, I did not pay that, number 94, number... 108. This guy rated this book at a four and a half, but I think he's wrong. This one's going to grade a lot higher than that. Anyway, got number 124 also. I'm trying to complete a uh, 100 issue run of the Defenders. I'm lacking a lot of the several of the early issues, but I was able to pick up number number six. Got uh, Green Lantern, number 112. Yeah. I had these when I was a kid, but uh, somehow they got traded away or stolen or whatever. Some of my friends were thieves, and I didn't find that out until later. Number 114. And 117. Hunted high and low, but... I can only find one issue of Fantastic Four that I needed that wasn't outrageous. So I picked up number 70. Got several Flash comics. Trying to complete a long run of that. I got 299, 316, classic Infantino cover, 318. 319 and 337 these next next ones are my guilty pleasure old ACG comics I uh, picked up number adventures into the unknown number 106 number 107 Number 117 and number 118. If you're not familiar with these, <clears throat> let me go ahead and tell you the stories in these are bad. 
they are formulaic they you can see the ending coming a mile away but they're just they're great they really are they're so bad that they're good I also picked up Unknown Worlds number five number eleven and number 46. Picked up a uh, good many Daredevil comics. Picked up number 17. Number 45. I've always loved this cover. The photo cover with the uh, artwork. It's great. Number 47. Tell you a little story about this issue. First place I ever read this story was in, I believe, Son of Origins of Marvel Comics when I was, I don't know, seven, eight years old. And when I saw this copy this, for cheap, which is definitely what it was, I had to pick it up. Even though, I, even though I've already read it, I've always wanted this issue. There it is, number 50. Number 60. Number 66. Number 93. Number 96. Number 98. Number 106. Number 108. Getting a little close there. Number 112. 116. I've always liked the owl as a villain. Don't know why. Anyway, 125. 145 and 156 also picked up a uh, good many Iron Man got a great deal on these Iron Man number 5 number 7 number 22 I mean how can you go wrong with this Iron Man the Crimson Dynamo and the Titanium Man I mean just wow that number 67 number 72 number 78 and number 88 Picked up a few Batman. I was anyway. I know these were. I can't remember if these came out of a fifty cent bin or if they were seven for a dollar or what they were. But anyway, picked up Gotham Knights number twenty nine. I think I need two to have all of those. Bad part is I had them in a hand at one time. And put them back anyway. Got Batman Eternal number thirteen. Number twenty five. I just like that cover. Don't know what the story is. Story might be crap, but I like that cover. 34. Also picked up uh, the new Dark Knight or New Er Dark Knight, number 24. Picked up the new series or the New Er series, Batman number 14. And 15. Batman 23.1 the ventriloquist and I got all-star Batman number one just picked it up because it was really cheap and it was a number one and I got Batman annual number three picked up a few Captain America at number 107 wanted that one for a long time, finally found a copy for cheap. 
133. One forty four, one six, one eighty seven, excuse me, one eighty nine, one ninety, two fourteen. Love Jack Kirby stuff, two twenty eight. 231, 374. I'm looking forward to reading this one. I mean, Bullseye and Captain America. I mean, what's, what's, <laughs> what's not to like? 378. And I got annual number 13. Captain America, the Chosen, number 1. Number three and number six. Yeah, bat, excuse me. Should I say Batman. Captain America Forever Allies number one. Captain America and Crossbones one shot. Captain America in the first thirteen one shot. The Korvac Saga, number three. I hadn't seen this one, so this is number three. But anyway, I may try to pick the other ones up. Captain America, Who Will Wield the Shield, number one. Not sure what this series is. Anyway, I know it's Captain Ultimate Captain America. Just saw it. Number one. Number two. And number four. Also picked up Captain America number 13 from one of the series back in the 90s. Picked up one Thor, number 236. Got Superman number 214. This one was definitely 20 cent out of the five for a dollar box. And I picked up 295. Found these in a seven for a dollar box. This was Marvel Tales number 42. Tales of Asgard number one. Had the JC Comics Hall of Fame Thunder Agents number three. Captain Marvel number 36. And this is. Silver Surfer number, I think it's number 14. Don't quote me on that, but anyway, it's the Silver Surfer and the Human Torch, so can't go wrong with that. Also got Strange Adventures number 201. Found this one, this was also a seven for a dollar. Superman Doomsday Hunter Prey number book one. Also picked up The Boys, number seven. This is kind of an infamous issue. For those of you who are familiar with this series, you know what I mean. Sergeant Fury, number 82. Conan, number 43. Kid Colt, number 131. Lone Wolf and Cub, number four. Love this series. Doing my darndest to try to get every one of them that I can find. All Winners Squad Band of Heroes number two. Band of Heroes number four. And Black Terror from Dynamite number thirteen. Uh, for some reason, my phone keeps going off, and this this one's done got to about twenty minutes, so I'm gonna cut this one off here 
anyway there is part three coming and that's where i get to the old stuff anyway thanks for watching uh and i'll see you here for too long with part three